Hi, and welcome to my playhouse. And this sucks. So, um, I was gonna be playing with faders today, and I have uh, manhandled these four batteries out here uh, from the battery room because it would be easier to play with them on the table here. And I wanted to put it uh, one of those 12 volt on here. But I carried this one out, I carried that one out, I carried this one out, and then I wanted to carry this one out, and I found that it, um, these are meant to be sealed gel batteries. It's not supposed to be venting out the side of the battery there, so unfortunately, I think these batteries are completely wasted by now. So that's a very big shame. I was so hoping to play with them one last time before they go to the to the recycling things for batteries. They're very old. These um these are from 2006-7. Oh, it actually says it's here. These are from 2006. So uh, they are nearing 20 years old, so, so can't really blame them. What a shame. And in here, at the high pitch battery room, we already have... Uh, okay, it measures. It's getting there. That one wasn't measuring correctly. To start with, it, it takes a bit of time to get there. And it's perfectly balanced, so all is good. But to play with the last Bluetooth, I kind of have to replace that, which is kind of... Uh, I really like this one with the display, so I want to have that one sitting on here. But these are the only four 12 volt batteries that I have, so I guess I will have to bite the bullet and, uh, and put the other fader on here. I have been working a little bit without you, so I have removed the awesome uh, battery balancer from Huaxio Tech, um, who has kindly sponsored this video because they sent me this one free of charge to show you guys. They did also send me that one that I just removed free of charge um, because I asked for it and um, I have problems with the name, so here it is again. Huaxio Tech. Yeah, Huaxio Tech. Um, it, it just doesn't roll off the tongue. There is a very big beneficial thing of this compared to the other one, and that is that it has a plug. And when you are connecting everything here, well, um, you're not connecting anything active. You're just connecting something uh, that ends in a plug that isn't connected to anything yet. So. All of this I have connected in the order that I think I do believe that the manual states that it's supposed to go the most positive battery which is this one where the positive lead goes out um, is there uh, and then it becomes the negative one over here so all the batteries are in a, in one series so it's four 12 volt batteries in a series and the balancer does so that all the batteries have the same voltage on there. Right now they're very well balanced. So there is not much, they're probably not gonna do anything, but it comes with a uh, with an app. So I will need to go and figure that out. But uh, yeah, I thought, let's connect it. It has another thing that I thought was a good thing, but I'm, I'm kind of worried about it. This is a metal box and the connector, well, the, the connector is long enough to go somewhere else, but well, I kind of like the plastic box uh, on top of the batteries like this. Like I also have this plastic tool from Tobias that I've been using to connect and disconnect everything with. And it's very nice to be working with plastic stuff when you're working with huge amount of amperage 
and these batteries might look small but they're like 50 amps each so this is like uh, what is that 52.2 volts 50 amps it's a lot of power and if something shorts out it's a big spark and uh, somebody might just shit his pants if that happened and therefore plastic is very nice to work with so um, let's try and connect this to the balancer and then i'll mess around see if i can i can install the app afterwards nothing's gonna happen this doesn't have any displays or anything so it's not as if anything is gonna happen so i should just plug it in let's see there no leds no nothing let's put it can it it can reach over there there and i'll take my phone and try and install the app on the qr code and see what happens okay so how many of you are screaming your lungs out that i'm an idiot and it says right there that it only works with an android system and not my iphone well um, you'd be right about that because i tried it on my iphone and it uh, directed me to google play store and then i i discovered that something must be up because uh, that's not how we rock luckily i do have an android device here my uh, tablet which um i was also so lucky there was still a little bit of power on that and um i was sitting upstairs and i was able to connect uh, i installed the app which is called battery it's a bit low on power uh, so it's uh, we don't actually need to sit on top of it but now we are battery and it finds it there we are connecting oh and it's on the other way around there so that's what we get including all the reflections and me up here uh, okay I thought that was my head it's actually the microphone so we get uh, some information here battery A battery B battery C and battery D all of them at 14 volts got a graph down here at the voltage we can try and turn this we can try connect it to the rest of the system see what happens there I'm expecting that we will get a peak or a, or it will do something I have no idea how often it uh, oh, oh oh okay so it actually went a little bit down Mm -hmm. I am sure this is very beneficial if you have a bunch of these batteries you can just have your phone and you can connect to one and the other and the third and it has a code here it does not s does not seem to have that code anywhere so you would you would have to connect one at a time and know what battery bank this is it tells us how long it has been running yeah this is a little bit of a bad test because the batteries are so perfectly balanced they have been on a balancer for months and months so uh, not that much going on i must admit very big benefit of this balancer is that connector that it has and i am um, crystal at huaxion uh, tech uh, sent me an extra cable so if i if this wasn't venting out the side here I would be able to connect these up and I could move the balancer in here and it could balance these batteries for the next month or two and then I could move the balancer back in to the other battery bank and it could do that one. I'm actually gonna go and check um, if a connector like this is available. The other part of this, it would be very cool to connect that to the balancer with all the leads that doesn't have a connector uh just want to check that hey i have been googling uh well mostly on aliexpress and this um this extra connector here what i want to do i want the other side of that and i want it to connect uh to this one this is the one with the displays 
So I could put a connector like this one, just the other side, on here, like something like that, uh, that, and then I can disconnect this easily from from one set of batteries to another set of batteries, and I can even take well, if I um, if I do it right and cut these wires the right length so that they they go in something like that. I can take these wires and I can make myself another set of wires because um, I ordered these these connectors. I got I got a pair of five for about five euros. So a, a male and a female is about a euro or a dollar. I think it's about the same. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing that. It will arrive in a week or 14 days or something. Um, Stuff from AliExpress is going a lot faster these days, so uh, so I'll easily be able to change to this awesome battery equalizer uh, just by disconnecting the other one and connecting this one, and it's gonna be cool. Uh, have we had the back of this? I don't think so. Can I? Ah, it's it's stuck on there really good. So yeah. So unfortunately, we didn't really get to see the the battery equalizer in, in work because my battery is perfectly equalized. But we do see the benefit because I was able to just go in there and disconnect this instead of having to, well, do this. Uh, so there is a big benefit of that. That was where this could have been cool if these batteries weren't so far gone that they had uh, decided to vent out the side of it, which is most definitely not gonna be working. So that was a bloody shame. I was so disappointed when I found that after carrying those heavy batteries out here, not entirely a wasted effort because they are going out anyway. They they are definitely dead. So uh, yeah, and this um, this thing, very easy to connect to uh, batteries and I asked very nicely to get this cable from um, from Crystal and uh, she supplied me an extra cable. Sure you would normally have to pay for this as well this is 50 cents and all of this crimping and wire things. I was actually looking if it was possible to purchase more of these cables but I wasn't able to find it. I was even looking at the, the different you can see there is like Come on. There is like black and red. Uh, there was plenty of these red ones for sale. The black one, not so much. It's not available at the moment. So uh, that was kind of weird. And it amazes me when I'm um, searching on AliExpress. Like you can get a hundred of these and it's like three, four dollars. You can get a thousand of them and it's a few dollars more. <laughs> really weird but as i might have mentioned i really like this equalizer balancer thing with the display so that i can snap my fingers and i can see what is going on so i'm gonna so when these cables get here i'm gonna i'm gonna change this one so that i can easily connect this one um to my batteries and just to be clear this one did work it connected perfectly with bluetooth to my tablet I must admit, I don't see the huge benefit at the moment, but if it was balancing, I might be able to see some more. Uh, there was that graph going on, so that could have been very interesting to see what would happen if the battery was out of balance, but yeah, couldn't do much there. But thank you very much to Crystal for um, supplying these uh, balancers. And if you have some batteries that needs balancing, well, I have left the links in the description, so go check them out. And you can always communicate with Crystal, she's very nice. Uh, thank you very much for watching my videos. Do subscribe to my channel so that you can see me again, and have a really nice day. Bye-bye.